What's happening fans? Welcome back to Earn and Reacts. Now this is a special video focused purely on Mr. Beast and what I have learned from his channel, okay? Very inspiring. This guy's on almost 50 million subscribers, but his views are absolutely insane, okay? Go and check Mr. Beast's channel out. Um, very, very, very good at making content. And I like his angles, the way he creates content and uploads it and and creates that 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 need that necessity to watch his videos um you want to see the next video so i've written some notes down because i've done some research and yeah for me this is everybody's dream is to create a youtube channel that you can live off without working you know or alongside your work you know uh, and being successful so for me as you guys already know i do music reactions so i'm always researching and, and looking up how to to better myself and you know i have many inspirations um from youtube so i've written some notes down from other youtubers and what they've said and, and research notes and things like that to help you guys as well improve your channels if you are a small youtuber or you're thinking about starting youtube or even if you are a big youtuber then i think these tips will really help you in your future content so the first thing i've written here is of course be yourself all right you've got to be yourself because at the end of the day if you're in it for the long term then people are going to pick up whether you're being fake or not you know, so for me, most importantly, when I do my content is being yourself. OK, but of course, that isn't enough for me. You know, you have to go that extra mile more. So, again, this is one that I'm going to be focusing on a lot more now is making unique content. So um, for me in the music reactions game, there's a lot of people reacting to the brand new music that's coming out. OK, but what what separates your content from your your opposition you know if you're doing vlogging or whatever what what separates you from being different from the next person and so that's what i've got to question myself this is these are the things that i've been researching that i'm going to incorporate into my videos but i think would benefit you guys as well so yeah definitely 100 percent. make unique content do something that's not been done before you know create some ideas write some things down and yeah come up with some ideas and just have a go and see what works you know i mean mr beast Be sorry mr beast was a gamer when he first started and he got to about 8000 subscribers posting for over 450 videos and then when he really started to change his content that's when he blown up so please focus on that as well make unique content something that's never been done before or that's been done very very less Okay, so challenge type videos, money and reactions slash big YouTube content. Um, so how to videos as well. So these are the kind of categories that after research, I found that, um, you know, whether it's to do with uh, giving away money or uh, money, just include money on your thumbnail. <laughs> if you're talking about money, put money on it um because again like with reactions this is why i do reactions because it's a highly sought for market a lot of people like to see people's reactions and in this day and age in 2020 a lot of people want to see what other people think you know and it's a massive massive market so again challenge type videos as well whether it's like a prank like prank videos are big as well so challenge if it's challenging yourself or it could be you know react to a whole album for example for my channel you know be react to an old album or um challenging your audience as well so i challenge you to do this or i challenge you to do that and it engages with the the audience as well as what i found and these views are just they're shooting up on these videos um so if you can link two three four or even five of these topics into one then you can see why um, people who do that get a lot of views. Now, if you look at Mr. Beast's channel, he does this. He links a lot of things in, so he includes money on his thumbnails most of the time and in his captions. The second thing, of course, is he's always doing challenges, some crazy ones. If you've seen the firework one, that's insane. Um, and the island, he's got so many different brilliant videos you know he's brought a car lot sold all the cars um he had his friends doing well some people who, who did a contest and four videos uh to win a million pounds and they had to keep their hand on on the the, the million pounds um so he's done really good content and he's combined all these things because he's realized 
that these are the things that are trend setting. You know, these are the things that are bringing in views. You know, these are the things that are unique. So yeah, that's, that's what I've written. So also as well, um, trying to help others and being positive within your videos. So again, you know, you're not just sitting there nodding your head if you're doing a reaction like, yeah, this is a good song. Let me know what you want to see in the gut. You're like, be, be like this, you know, be, be positive, be strong with your body language. Body language is very, very important as well to keeping people on, on focused on your video, keeping people here, you know, clapping, stuff like that. First thing I do when I come in is clap, you know, because I want people's attention when they're watching my videos. So I think being positive, knowing, letting your audience know that you want to help them as well, you know, in whatever way, entertain them, make them happy, whether it's give it away. If you can afford it, giveaways, giving them money, things like that, you know, it keeps people engaged, keeps people sharing your name and sharing your YouTube channel. Okay, the next thing I've got uh, that I've put here is work with what you've got. I watched a video of Mr. Beast where he was saying that when he first started out, he had an iPhone 5. And he managed to get to, I think it was 100,000 subscribers with an iPhone 5. So please, if you haven't got much... Uh, equipment and you're thinking about starting a YouTube channel, please just do it. Just do it. That's what I did. Just do it. You know, I paid not even £200 for my computer, you know, and I've still got the same computer now. I just added, you know, ring light, better soundproof, you know, camera, etc., better mic. Um, so start with what you've got. You know, he, he said on his, on his video that, you know, even if you've got next to nothing, save up a dollar a week or a pound a week you know, whatever country you're in, euro a week, until you can get yourself a camera, until you can get yourself a better thing, you know. Um, another another one as well is for all the monetized YouTubers out there, is invest your money that you make onto YouTube back into your YouTube channel, you know. It, whether it's 50%, 20%, put some of that money back into your YouTube channel. Uh, and that's what I do, you know, is I earn very little, but... With the money that I do in from YouTube, some of it goes back into, you know, uh, soundproofing and things like that. So that's something else that I learned as well. Uh, very important. Um, also, 10 to 20 minute videos, short, snappy intros. So don't make your intros too long. You know, don't be, if you're, if you're doing reaction videos, just find out who you are. You know, find out who you are and, and just run with it, but with short, snappy intros. And apparently the key point, the, the key kind of times uh, for YouTube videos is between 10 and 20 minutes. Because one, it's not too long, so people don't leave. Uh, and it's not too short that, you know, you're not earning enough ad revenue from them videos. So between 10 and 20 minutes and short, snappy intros. I always try and do that, short, snappy intros. Some of these things I already do, okay? That work for me. I mean, I've I've gained over three thousand two hundred subscribers now, three thousand two hundred fifty in less than six months. So what I'm doing must be working, okay? But I think if we together as a YouTube community, as a YouTube team, um, take all these points on board, what Mr. Beast has done and more, um, I think we can just grow together as a community. And also for me as well, one of the points that I haven't covered is collaborating. You know, building relationships with other YouTubers, not just messaging them and saying, let's do a collab, you know, build a relationship up with them first, you know, and um, if they want to to do a collab, then great. If not, then just just try. Just keep trying. Keep trying. I've done a couple of collabs, you know, um, and it's really enjoyable. And of course, one of the kind of points that I've figured out um, is to do things that you enjoy. When Mr. Beast makes his content, you can tell that he enjoys it. You know, he puts smiles on people's faces by giving them stuff, you know, making their day better. Um, so, yeah, make your content focused around how you can help people is a, is a very key point for me. But guys, if you do want me to make some more videos on the Mr. Beast or any other YouTuber, any big YouTuber, please drop it in the comments below and I'll do some research. No problem at all. No problem. If I can help, then that would be fantastic. Um, of course, you know, we can all grow together and we can all we can all make it. We can definitely can because YouTube now is bigger than ever and so many people are watching it. 1.5 billion accounts have been made, I think, on YouTube. It's going to be even more than that now. I think that was a statistic uh, not so long ago. So it's it's just growing every single day. 
But if you have enjoyed this content, guys, most importantly, don't forget to subscribe below. Hit that notification bell so you don't miss any future videos. And again, if you've got any recommendations for me to react to a certain video, whether it's a prank, music, or any other entertaining video, drop it in the comments below. Thank you for being here, guys. Take it easy, stay safe, be well, and I'll see you in the next video. Peace.